Oh, so this Saturday, one of the biggest fights in women's boxing history is taking place. It's for the undisputed world middleweight championship between England's Savannah Marshall and the US's Clarissa Shields. They're both undefeated and it's, it's really big. Uh, they're both big portions of the world titles between them. Shields is the WBC, WBA and RBF champion. Marshall's the WBO champion. And there's like a genuine bad blood between them as well. I've been watching some of the uh, sit down interviews between them both and it's been really tense. You know, like, you know, you should watch it. It's really interesting stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna watch uh, some Savannah Marshall highlights today. She's the bigger puncher of the two. She is. Uh, she's twelve and zero with ten. Is it twelve and zero with ten knockouts? I believe. Now, I've been watching Marshall for a while. I remember watching one of her early fights, uh, and she was boxing at super middleweight at the time. And she's tall. She's like my height, five eleven. I haven't watched all of her fights though. Nice body shot. Point, it was no longer competitive. She was just taking the right hands of Marshall was feeding her. He would then in there. Fair enough. Over. So, to there, so basically she was getting beaten up the whole fight. You know, the referee just called it a day. No point in a fighting. This one I watched. This was the first time I watched a fight. And I think it was like one of your typical soft opponents. That you feed to prospects. It seemed like. And I just kept thinking, you know, this girl's really tall. Like, I don't think I'd ever watched a girl in the super middleweight division fight before. Yeah, she's got real nice variety of punches. The way she, you know, she's switching up them hooks, you know, body and head uppercuts in there too. No, she's a, she's a good boxer. She doesn't look like she's tried trying really hard as well. Just letting her hands go. Hannah Rankin, who's a world champion, I think, at the moment. Oh, shit. Ooh. No, that's brutal. She's actually, she's, uh, she went down to light middle after this and had more success. Hannah Rankin. She looks really relaxed. Yep, she's trained by uh, one of Tyson Fury's uncles. He actually at one point trained Tyson. Great courage, great 
She just looked undersized compared to her. Too small compared to Marshall. Shots, everything. She was just a fantastic, uh, really, really brilliant performance. Not this one. Maria Lindbergh. Marshall. She's a very good fighter. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. She looks bigger than a lot of her opponents. She's big for a middleweight. I mean, I, I think 5'11 was, would be big for it. Like a, a male middleweight as well. That's like, that's proper super middleweight height, that is. Experience to get through these ten rounds. It's, it's a good advantage to have, having all that point in reach. Somehow, I bet. She risks that. Nice. And blood to the nose, and she shakes her head. And it was short notice, and it looked mission impossible, and she's going to sit it out. That was a good performance. Okay, I think I might leave it like that though, you know, in case the video gets too long. But, but yeah, Savannah Marshall was really impressive, and uh, yeah, she just dominates all of her opponents. And that's the case with shields as well, because I'm going to watch some shields uh, in my next video. And uh, yeah, so something's got to give. I mean, hopefully it's going to be a really competitive fight for a change, because I think both of them are just really used to dominating their opponents. You know, to see who wins. Uh, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it.